the select tool is a wrapper that will run either L select, S select, or V select, depending on your selection conditions. It can't be found in the mesh machine menu, but is keymapped to Alt left mouse by default. The same keymap Blender uses for loop selecting. You can change that keymap in the mesh machine preferences, but note that it is very much intended to be the same as the keymap for loop select. Now, if you use a different key config, you should update the key map for the tool in the add-on preferences accordingly. Users of the industry-compatible key map may want to turn this into double-click and remove the Alt key modifier. Then just make an initial selection and press your loop select key map, Alt left mouse in my case. It works exactly like L select or S select. For L select, the minimum angle is exposed in the redo panel again. And if you select a sharp edge, S select instead of L select will be invoked. But you can switch to L select if you want. In addition to L select and S select, V select is also supported. To access V select, you just have to be in vertex mode on a mesh with vertex groups. Then again, make an initial selection and use the key map. If your initial selection belongs to multiple vertex groups, the full V select modal HUD will come up. Check out the V select video for details. Finally, note that if the initial conditions for L select, S select or V select are not met, Mesh Machine will just pass through to Blender. What this means is that you can still use Blender's native loop select, and via the very same keymap, just as long as you don't have any isolated selected edges present. 